Right now, I'd like to introduce you to my girl, my number one bud. Say hello to Lucy. Yeah, All right. yeah. <laughs> I can hear you guys. How you feeling, Lucy? I'm feeling so great today, David. How about you? I am set. You ready to meet these contestants? Yeah, let's go. All right. First up, we got Aaron. Aaron, tell us about yourself. Well, I'm in the seventh grade. I'd like to be a professional singer, and I enjoy soccer and cheerleading. All right. Yeah, cheerleading. Give me an L, a U, a C, a Y. That spells Lucy. <laughs> Don't get Lucy started, Aaron. We'll be here all day. Well, welcome. Glad you could join us. And we got Caleb. Tell us about you, buddy. Hi. I'm also in the seventh grade. I enjoy playing with my two-year-old brother, Chad, and I like to watch professional wrestling with my 13-year-old brother, Charles. Oh. Yeah. Caleb, I gotta ask you, are, uh, are you and Charles a, a tag team? No. You guys don't have a tag team We're wrestling singles. team? We go against each other. You're singles, okay. That makes sense. <laughs> and finally, we got Nikki. How you doing, Nikki? Pretty good. How are you? I'm great, thank you. Tell us about you. Well, I'm also in the seventh grade, and in my free time, I enjoy playing basketball and making websites on the internet. Wow, you Ooh. make websites? Yes. Right on. Great shit. Maybe you could make the uh, first Lucy fan homepage. Yes, for all that's Lucy's me. fans. Pretty cool. That's pretty cool. All right. Well, here's how the game works real easy. Spin the wheel, pick a letter. Letters in the puzzle, you get the points. If you solve the puzzle, you win a great prize and you get to keep those points. Now, the person who has the most points at the end of the puzzles, you get to go on to the bonus round, all right? Now, let's take a look at the wheel. We've got our first physical stunt today. That's Match It right there. We also have www.wheel2000.com. That's our website. That's our site that all you guys at home can get on anytime you want to. But today, if you guys land on it, someone else who's already hit our website, the lucky emailer gets a chance to win with you. Okay? Right. We also got our bad spots on the wheel. You got to be careful. We got the Ooh. loser spot over there. You hit loser. that, you get the big L. Boom. Loser. Not cool. We skipped it. You lose your turn. And of course, the dreaded creature beneath the wheel. He's big. He's mean. He's nasty. He makes all the lights go out. Be careful. And he'll eat all your points. All right? Now, backstage, Aaron, you won the coin toss, so that means you get to go first. So here you go. Three categories. Lucy, show them yes. to us. Okay. The three categories for this round are... Body, lab test, and VIPs. Woohoo! You get to pick one of those, Aaron. Which one do you like? I'd like lab test. You got okay. it. Right. There you go. All righty, lab test is our first puzzle. Spin the wheel. Come on, Aaron. Good first spin. Oh, my God. All righty, there we go. Yeah. Right up the mat, we hit match it. It's our physical game. Let's go. All right, Aaron, come on up. Yeah. This is match it. What you do is we got four colored helmets right here, and what you have to do is you have to match them with the colors on our space aliens down here. All right, they're here, here, and here. Once you got the helmets on, then you come back, you hit this button to see how many you have right. The panel will light up. One, two or three, okay? If you get all three right, then the randomizer, which is constantly shuffling letters around, will freeze on three letters for you. Now, if you have less than three, then you go back, switch the helmets around, come back over here, hit the button, and see how many you have right. Now, if the 60 seconds runs out, what you're going to do is put on your last helmet, come over here, hit the button, and however many you have right, the randomizer will freeze those letters for you. Are you ready to match them? Yes. All right, on your mark, get set, match it. Come on, Aaron, you can do this, yeah. All right, interesting, let's go. Uh-huh. Good job, get them on there quick. Come on over, check it out. None right, nice. none right. Switch them all around. Aaron, come on. Keep going. Switch them around, switch them around, you got it. Keep going, 30 seconds, 30 seconds, one more time. Still none, change them all around. You might want to switch that. Still none, put them in all new places, 15 seconds. 
15 seconds. Nice job, but let's go back. Nice try. Woo, those space aliens were just not agreeing with you today, Aaron. Not nice space aliens. Well, tough luck on the match. It that means we're gonna go on, and Caleb, your turn to spin the wheel. All right. Come on, Caleb. Good spin, yeah. All right, now remember the category is lab test, and you have 250. Is there an end? No, there's no end. No end. All right, Nikki, your turn. Come on, Nikki. Come on, Nikki. All right. Lamb dunk it, girl. Let's go. Looks like the double up question. Now, that means I'm going to read you a question. If you get this right, you double the points on that spot, so you'll be playing for 1,000 if you can answer this question correctly. The category is... Some boats carry a certain kind of instrument for detecting and locating objects underwater. Now, you have three choices. A, a microwave, B, sonar, or C, pulsar. B, sonar? Sonar is correct. Oh, yes! Yeah! Now, what that means, Nikki, is you are now playing for 1,000 points. Pick us a letter. Is there an S? No. No S's. Well, back to you, Aaron. But she learned something. <laughs> That's right, Luke. Come on, Aaron. All righty, 650. Cool. Is there an R? Yes, one R. <laughs> All right, you have 650. That's more than enough to buy a vowel, or you can spin or solve it if you know it. I'd like to spin. All right. Spin that wheel. Be sure of yourself. Come on, Aaron. Two fifty. I'd like a T, please. Yes, one T. All right. Mm. Taking up to nine hundred, enough to buy a bell or spin it. Spin. You cool. got it. Come on, Aaron. Fifty. Um, an F, please? No, there's no F. No Fs. Caleb, no points, but you got a chance now. Hey, David, that's why I don't play the game, because I have no clue. That's why you're in the puzzle, Lucy. That's right. Well, not to mention, you're much prettier than me. <laughs> 250. Is there a P? Yes, there's one P, Caleb. There you go. <laughs> now we've got some letters on the board. 250, enough to buy a vowel, or you can spin again. I'd like to spin. All righty. Okay. Go, Caleb. Do it. Yeah. Watch out for the creature. Oh, no. Oh, he yeah. made it. Woo. 200. Is there a G? No, there's no G. Oh, geez. Nikki, chance for you to get some points here. Come on, Nikki. Four hundred. All right, is there an H? An H? No, there's no H. Oh, H. Sorry. Aaron, back to you. Nine hundred. You can buy a vowel or spin it. I like to buy a vowel. Buy a okay. vowel. An E? Yes, two E. Good e choice. Nice buy. Good job. Good choice. Six hundred and fifty and a bunch of letters up there. What do you want to do? Ten. <laughs> okay. Okay. Good, Aaron. Go. We gotta skip you, but you get to keep your points. Caleb, I would your like turn. To spin. You got it. Okay. Go, Caleb. Maybe next time, Aaron. Coming up on the big points. Oh, there we go. Yeah. Yeah. All right, Caleb. Pick a good one. It's for a thousand. Is there a V? Yes, there's a V. Mm. He knows. 
hell is All right, you know what that sound means. Just vowels left, so you can buy a vowel or solve it. I'd like to solve the puzzle. What is it? Evaporate. You got it. That a boy, good job. High five, Carolyn. Ah! Lucy, what's yeah. going on? Tell me about some evaporation. Well, actually, I have very high-status friends, okay? My buddy Brandon Hammond from the new CBS TV show, The Gregory Hines Show, knows something about that. Thanks, Lucy. When laundry dries, the water seems to disappear, but it doesn't really. It evaporates and turns into water vapor, an invisible gas which mixes with the air. Bye. That my laundry just seems to disappear. I'm always losing socks and stuff. Good job, Kayla. You did it good so well. We're gonna give you a color television with remote control. Yeah. Not only did you win that great prize, but you get to keep your 1,250 points. And we will be right back with more Real Two Thousand. back welcome to round two we got a new spot on the wheel big points two thousand points right there right. let's take a look at our categories we got two old ones and one new one lucy they're coming everybody word rep yeah and vip all right thank you lucy it took a while but they're there <laughs> yeah Caleb, a lot today. which one of those do you like i like word rap yeah. Word rap it is, buddy. Lucy, show us the puzzle. All right. There you go. <laughs> Thank you, Lucy. Nice beatbox. All right, Caleb, start us off. I'm into the tunes. I know. Six fifty, Caleb. Is there an L? No, no L. No L's. Nikki, give that wheel a spin. Come on, Nikki. Come on, Nikki. <laughs> nice even puzzle there. Yeah, that is. Very neat and orderly, new Lucy. I try, David. 250, Nikki. All right, is there an S? Yes, one S. Yes. Right. You have 250, just enough to buy a vowel, or you can spin. I think I'll spin. Okay. She's got to rack up those points before she's going to do any shopping. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> Lucy, I said Nikki could spin. <laughs> oh, I thought that was a cue or something. You hit the double up, Nikki. Yeah! All right, you know how it works. Here's your question. Which of the following is not an example of a conjunction? And, but... Or a pawn. A pawn? A pawn is correct. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Nikki, go to the <laughs> that means if you a thousand dollar letter, pick wisely. Is there a T? Yes, one T. Wow. <laughs> that gives you 1,250, enough to buy a vowel where you can spin. I think I'll spin. All right. Go, Nikki. Do it. Oh. Up to you. Did very well. Took advantage of the double up, but uh-oh, here comes the oh, creature! No! Oh, that mean old nasty guy shows up right after the double up. Sorry, Nikki. Aaron, Sorry, it's Nick. to you. Give the wheel a good spin. Give it a big spin. Come on, Aaron. There you go. Got a little extra push on that one. Looks like you're coming up on the prize. Just passed it for 600. Is there an R? No, there's no R's, Aaron. Caleb, back to you. Come on, Caleb! Couple letters up, but still no points this round. Oh, 450. Is there an N? Yes, there are three N's. Uh-oh, three N's. Fifteen fifty. What's it gonna be? I'd like to spin. All right. Come on, Caleb. Spin the wheel. <laughs> oh no, no! Oh, Get away from that creature! Oh, no. <laughs> well, the creature.
appreciate you taking all the points. And you guys hang on a second. We'll be right back. We're going to go to a commercial. When we come back, more Wheel 2000. <laughs> Continuing on with our puzzle, Nikki, your spin. Right. Come on, Nikki! Word wrap is our category. Oh, no, not again. Stay away from the creature. <gasps> Ooh. Oh. 650. Is there a G? No, there's no G. All right, Aaron. Give it a shot. Come on, Aaron. Come on, Aaron. Is there a C? Yes, there's two C's. C, C. Two C's. Nice job. Gives you 700. <laughs> okay, that sound means that time is up, so what's going to happen is I'm going to give the wheel one final spin. I'm going to ask you to give me a letter, and after you do that, you will then have five seconds to solve the puzzle. Vowels are going to be worth nothing, and consonants look like they're going to be worth 500. Not bad, okay? Aaron? Still your turn? Pick a letter. E. Yes, there's three E's. Five seconds e, to solve. E, e. Word wrap. Oh, no. Caleb. No, go ahead. Pick a letter. P. Yes, one P. Now you have five seconds to solve. Compound sentence. Compound yeah! sentence is right. What the Good job! Lucy! Yeah? Tell me about that compound sentence. Hey, a compound sentence consists of two or more independent clauses joined together by a conjunction. Like, Wheel 2000 is totally cool and you win great prizes! Yeah! All right. A little grammar lesson there. Caleb, for knowing compound sentence, you just won a water theme park season pass! Yeah. All right. Congratulations. Well, we're out of time, so let's check out the scores. Aaron and Nikki, no points today, but thank you very much for coming. We got some great parting gifts for you guys. Great job. Hey, Caleb, the big winner today. You got yeah. the color TV. You got the water theme park season pass. You got 1,750 points. And when we come back, Caleb and I, we're going to the bonus round. With me. Don't forget me, David. Oh, yeah. And Lucy, too. <laughs> Bonus round. Caleb, choose your prize, A or B? Well, he knows what he wants. He's going yes, for A. Okay, Lucy, cool. show us that category. Okay, the category is person. Category's person. Now, Caleb, the way it works is we're going to give you R, S, T, L, N, E. Lucy, any of those in the puzzle? Yes, there are two N's, one S, one T, and two E's. Ooh. We helped him out a lot. That's a lot of help. Now, you still get three consonants and one vowel. Okay, a C, mm -hmm. an M, okay. a P, and an I. Okay. C-M-P-I. Well, I can give you two I's. All right, Caleb. Ten seconds, buddy. Read it. Woo. Woo. Einstein. Yeah. Einstein is right. You are the big winner. Open it up. Open it up. See what you got. Woo! You just won a blimp ride for you Woo! and a buddy. You're going up, flying around. Not to mention you won that color TV. You also won the water theme park season pass. Lucy, great game, great day. Congratulations, Taylor. We'll see you next time right, on Wheel 2000. Remote control. Hey, a season pass for 
four people to any Six Flags theme and water park in the country. A flight for two over Southern California for the Goodyear Airship Eagle.